By the end of this video, you will be able to make your voice deeper using the software Audacity. You will be able to take a recording that sounds something like this. How to deepen your voice in Audacity. And make it sound like this. How to deepen your voice in Audacity. Let's get started. So you will want to have Audacity open, and you will want to have an audio recording to work with. So you can either do that by pressing the record button here, or you can go up to file and then import and then audio. Once you have your file ready to go, you can then start editing your file by selecting it. You can either select the clip by clicking the top portion here with the little hand, or you can select the entire track by clicking this gray portion here. And lastly, you could have the selector icon highlighted and then just select the portion you would like to work with. So I have that selected. And now I'm going to go up to effect. And the first thing you wanna do is go to pitch and tempo and change pitch. This is the best tool for wanting to make your voice deeper within Audacity. So you will want to go down to the frequency part of this tool and you can see there's a knob here that you can drag to the right or the left and it changes the percent change. If you go to the right and it's a positive number, you're going to make your voice higher. If you go to the left and it becomes a negative number, it will make your voice deeper. So if you want something that's subtle, you can do like a negative one and then you can preview that. How to deepen your voice in Audacity. Okay, so it sounds a little bit like the original voice, but a little deeper. But I want to go a lot deeper with this recording. So I'm going to go something like negative 25, and now I'm going to preview that. How to deepen your voice in Audacity. Perfect. You'll notice there's an option on the bottom of this tool that says use high quality stretching. And that means it's going to take a longer time to process. It's slow. I always have that selected because I want it to have a better quality when I'm done with it. And it will take a little time depending on how long of recording that you're changing the sound to. But for this short recording, it won't take very long. So I will have that selected. And now that I'm happy with that, I can click apply. Again, you can continue to experiment with that tool to make sure that you're happy with what you come up with. Now, right now I could export this and go up to file and then export. And then I could export it as an MP3 or a wave, but I would like to tweak the audio a little more. So I'm gonna have that audio selected and then click on effect. And I'm going to go up to EQ and filters. And now you could either do bass and treble or filter curve EQ. They would do similar things. I'm going to click on bass and treble and I'm going to go ahead and put this back to the defaults. So I can click on the bass and I can drag that to the right and that will make the bass deeper uh, and more pronounced. You could also take the treble and drag that to the left if you would like to. Again, the more you alter the sound, the more artifacts you might get or the more that you might degrade the quality of the audio. So every time you add another effect, make sure that you keep that in mind as you are working with your audio. So I'm going to go ahead and click on preview. How to deepen your voice in Audacity. That sounds pretty good. So I'm going to click on apply. And if you would like to make this audio sound a little better, what you can do is go up to uh, effect and then you can click on compression, volume and compression, and then click on compressor. And I'm going to just use the default here and click on preview. How to deepen your voice in Audacity. And then click on apply. So you now know how to deepen your voice using Audacity. A couple things to keep in mind is while you're working with your audio, as I mentioned before, the more effects that you apply to your audio, the more you might degrade the audio or you might get artifacts, uh, some different uh, sounds that are sounding unnatural with your audio. Or you might have had background noise, which as you boost the bass, you might have hearing, you might be hearing that background noise more. I actually have another video that shows you how to remove background noise from your audio using Audacity. I'll put a link to that video here.